Hey guys, it's Michelle Patterson here with Angel Souls and today's video is going to be about some of the nice things that I'm starting to get in the mail. <laughs> so I had the camera all set up so you could see more of the tree and everything, but you know, I mean, I'm just doing what I can here. So first and foremost, Black Friday. So all of those sales, if they get too crazy, I'm not usually into it. You know what I mean? I'll just kind of back off and be like, whatever. But when it comes to things like skincare <laughs> and makeup, this is the, really the time of year that I stock up on this stuff because I can save a little bit of money and I do go through quite a few things I'm going to show you here in just a little bit uh, to do videos. So first and foremost, I haven't gotten all of them from Target, but let's start with this one. They had these gift boxes. Let me just put it right in front of my face. Why the heck not? <laughs> they had these gift boxes. I believe this one was priced at like 20 and then it had a certain percentage off, like 20% off or something like that. Um, if you can still catch this deal, if these things look good to you, there's magnetic lashes, pre-glued lashes, Insta-Dry nail polish, which I'm all about. Look at that cute cuticle oil. Polish remover. Uh, what is that? Oh yeah, there's two Real Techniques tools in there. One's a brush and one is a sponge. There's a primer. I think that's an eye primer and a tweezer man mini tweezer. I mean, that is incredible. Now I got this because, you know, as you might imagine, <laughs> I would use all of this in preparation for a video. If not, you know, especially the lashes or something like that, having those. So that's a great thing to have and what a cheap way to do it, right? Then I got this, get smart about your skincare this season with six mini products your face will love. <laughs> That's not what it is, great complexions. Uh, this I got again from Target online. This was a Black Friday special. I believe these kits, the next two, no, excuse me. This one was $19.99, I'm gonna show you this in just a moment. I believe this one was maybe $14.99 with a certain percentage off. But you see that deep cleansing oil, what is it, DHC? right there you guys that stuff is incredible i have very 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 sensitive skin and i especially have sensitive skin around my eyes and the slightest allergen anything will make my eyes swell up i should tell you guys if you hear a hissing i have the well you can't really see it can you <laughs> i have the fireplace going right there so that is the fireplace <laughs> i can't tell it to stop Okay, it, it, it's just gonna do its thing, all right? But yeah, we have two cool for school all-in-one egg mellow cream. I've never, it's a moisturizer. I've never used that. There's a Neutrogena Hydro Boost in here and a ginger vitamin C serum shot. All kinds of great things in here. I mean, and, and such a great value. I went to my local Target today and they still had some of these around but it doesn't look like they were doing the discount anymore but you know if for next time if you catch those uh kits they're amazing they they really are now this one i also got from target but look guys it's derm store now if you don't know can you see it <laughs> there we go dermstore.com derm store has always done right by me they are so good and they usually have 20 percent off of things so things that don't typically go on sale, you can get from Derm Store. And look at this travel case. Yes, it's just, I mean, it's sturdy enough. It'll probably last a little while, but I love this because I hate traveling with even like a carry-on anymore because it's so stressful to like fight people to get on the plane, to get a spot overhead. Just a side note, and just, just how I think flights should go. Yes, we're going on a tangent. Come with me, won't you? Uh, first and foremost, the overhead bin space. If I purchased a ticket, there should be an assigned overhead bin space for my seat. It should just come with the ticket and you should get the under seat and something above. Secondly, if you're going to make the seats recline, they should recline into their own space and not recline back into someone else's space. That way, if you want to recline, you're taking up your own leg room and not somebody else's. Just saying. But anyway, the bag that I take, I went to Ross and found this. <laughs> I am so practical, I, I can't even tell you. But I found this perfect sized bag. Um, and my travel bags, I don't spend a lot on travel bags. Are you kidding me? Those things are going on those nasty belts. They're going where people's feet have been. You're going into public restrooms with that thing. It's gonna get banged up. Why would you pay a lot of money for that? These people who have Louis Vuitton luggage, I'm like, <sighs> 
okay, now you're really saying something. Like, you, you can afford to have that thing wrecked, right? So anyway, this little guy is going to be perfect for, I'm gonna take a mini bag. This may not be the right thing for everyone to do, but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take like my chargers and everything, I'm gonna stick them in like a little square pouch. I'll stick that in one section. I'll probably put them in a plastic baggie too, just to be safe. And then I'll put my travel makeup. Um, and now I have that Real Techniques brush out of this, which is a, <laughs> sticker came off, um, which is a shorter handled brush out of the one kit that I was showing you. So that's gonna be like a perfect size to pop into my little bag. So that stuff can go in there and then I can just stick it like this in my little bag and it'll still go under the seat. Now, sorry about the side rant, okay? <laughs> sorry about going off on a tangent. All right, so here's this cute little bag. It even has like a little derm store. Let me see if I can get a little, get a little focus. Can we do a little focus? There we go. So there's that. And, you know, I'm just gonna take these up really quick. So again, I get some travel-sized items that I can take with me. This stuff, I've been very curious, I've just been getting the Garnier version <laughs> of this. So I'm very curious to try that. And that is, I don't know, 3.33 ounces. Ooh, is that right under travel size? <laughs> Just by a smidge or something like that. And then we have this brand, which I've seen, First Aid Beauty. Um, I don't think I've, I think maybe I've tried like samples of this, but there's that. And again, guys, this was, I think, $19.99. <coughs> she did. Um, sorry, <laughs> sorry about that. Um, I have tried, what was I saying? I think it was saying that I've tried the, uh, Oh no. Oh, these are the face pads, facial radiance pads. What are you? Help exfoliate, tone, and brighten. Cool. All right. And then we have Skin Medica. But I, was, I think I was saying that these were just, uh, this was just 20 bucks and then there was like 20% off or something like that. So there's that. Or 30%? Was it 30%? I'm not really sure. Um, ooh. This part I was very, I mean, it's just the tiniest little thing, but it's a Sunday Riley product. I absolutely adore Sunday Riley. I love using their products and I'm always happy to try a new one. And then there was this Manuka Honey Cleansing Balm, uh, Naturopathica. So there is that. And I'm gonna dig it out of the back here. This little guy, what is this? Hydro Cool Firming Eye Gels, which is phenomenal because for me, it's all about the eye care. So there is that great little bag that I got from the good Target. So I had to return some garland. <laughs> I, I bought some garland from Target that I was gonna put up here on my mantle. And when I got it, it was like that paper stuff. And I was like, no. <laughs> so I returned it. And I went back to the back and it was empty. And I was like, okay, either they sold out of everything or they're really slow on stocking. Turns out they had a bunch of stuff in and they just got wiped out. And the guy was so cute and so sweet. And he was, I got fuzzies everywhere. <laughs> um, he was so cute and so sweet. And he kept going to the back and trying to find me some girl. And I'm like, you know what? We're just gonna have to give up. <laughs> it's cool, whatever. All right, so what is the next thing I can tell you about? So the next thing would be my Beautylish order. Now, Beautylish, if you guys saw my other video, that's where I got my Shane Dawson Jeffree Star palette, the conspiracy palette, with a pig mirror and a makeup bag. And when they shipped the box, first of all, they were wrong about how long it was gonna take, which is fine. <laughs> you know, that was kind of a hard thing to judge. But when they shipped the box, they didn't put the palette in the box. That was the only, although that's pretty bad. I mean, for, you know, the whole thing was to get the palette and then you didn't put it in there, <laughs> right? So it was pretty bad, but they got on it and they took care of it. Every other time I've ever gotten an order through Beautylish, they're amazing. Uh, I think Beauty Bay and Beautylish, people always have really good things to say about that. Now, I already tore into this box because I am human. I cannot just simply sit and look at things until I have a time to sit down and, and film. So this is what happened. I went on the Jeffree Star Cosmetics website. I tried to get some stuff. The website was being wonky. Things were selling out really fast, which was ticking me off. 
And uh, same thing happened with the killer merch. I tried to get a robe uh, and a hoodie from the Shane merch. And it was, it literally took me 10 seconds once I got on and it was already sold out. And I gotta tell you guys, I, I got like, I, I mean, I love Shane Dawson. I love Jeffrey, but I'm done. I'm done. I'm not showing up for any more restocks. I'm not going to sit there and have things constantly be sold out. I, I can't do that. <laughs> I, can't, I can't emotionally do that. But anyway, so when I was trying to, on it was Thanksgiving, when I was trying to get some stuff from Jeffree Star's website where it wasn't working, I went over to Beautylish and they packed this box so that it was so beautiful. I really should have taken a shot of it before I just like went at it, but it was so beautifully done. It was like I was opening a beautiful present. So the first thing that I got, now if you're a Jeffree Star hater, you might want to click off. This is not the video for you, okay? There, I have plenty of other uh, content if you want to tune into that. So first of all, I wanted to point out this cute, can you see it? Let me get a lamp on that. You see the cute little shiny sticker? <laughs> I don't, it's the little things that make me so happy. So I finally got one of the Jeffree Star Star Mirrors. I've already taken it out, so it has fingerprints on it. <laughs> but if ever you get a mirror that is from the Jeffree Star collection, it will come in this like foam, foam box. I got the popsicle ones a long time ago. And, uh, yeah, I mean, it's, it's this awesome, like purple metallic, I don't need to show you the other side, but you get, <laughs> you get that it's a mirror. Um, I got the popsicle ones and they came in, you know, the foam was shaped for the popsicles so that they travel very, very safely. And back at that time, I thought I was going to miss the boat on them and I didn't, I caught them when they were on sale and they were giving away a free liquid lip with every mirror. I don't know if it was every mirror, but I got one for each mirror that I bought which was really cool. So I finally got my mirror <laughs> that I wanted. Turns out I am collecting these. I didn't mean to, but I guess I am. So as I said, I already tore into stuff. Um, oh shoot. Oh no. One of the products isn't sitting here. Shoot. Well, it's on my lips. It is, I think it's called Sky High and it is the Jeffree Star lip gloss. Uh, I didn't bring over. It's in my bathroom because I was using it this morning. <laughs> but yeah, so I already tore into these. But this is a liquid lip that I got in, come on now, come on lens, in poinsettia. Is it really not good? There we go. Why is it doing this? My lens has been so weird recently. I don't love it. Okay, anyway. <laughs> There is the color. You can kind of see it under the lights. Um, I'm not big into swatching because I think swatches are icky because then it's like all over my hand. And I'm not a beauty guru, so I have, <laughs> I'm under no obligation to do swatches, but you can get a feel for that. It's, it's kind of, um, it's the first time I've owned this and it is a red. It's an orange, on me it feels like, it's like an orangey red with a lot of uh, shine to it. Um, it's not quite what I expected. Don't hate it, but it's not quite what I expected. So there is that. The next thing I got, <laughs> which is already out, um, I finally got some Jeffree Star lip scrub. Now I was trying to get the raspberry one and then I think there was a watermelon one or something. Sold out, sold out, sold out, getting crazy, getting crazy. So I ended up with the spearmint one. I have not tried this yet. Oh my gosh, it really does smell amazing. It's just gorgeous and the packaging is really cool too. The only thing is this lid, if you don't get it on just so before you start, <laughs> I had a hard time with this actually. I went to slap it on and it got crooked and I couldn't get it back off. Minor thing, but there you go. And it's really kind of, it's a lot here. This is a heavy jar. How much is here? One ounce. Okay. So there's that. I got that. Um... Here's, here's the box from the gloss. <laughs> I didn't bring the actual gloss over. I'm so sorry guys, but the important thing is it's on my lips and it's just, it's, it's got, it's kind of a white color, but with like, like rainbowy kind of shift to it. Um, it's just cute. Can you see anything? <laughs> that doesn't help. Okay. So anyway, that's what the box looks like. I don't have it. It was cute packaging. It has that really big, uh, cap on it if you're really curious as to what it looks like millions of other people have already done reviews on it okay so there is that then what else did i get 
so the final thing that I bought was this BKR uh, water, what do they call it? Water balm. Okay. Uh, this I got as a sample in some, I don't remember which one, some subscription box. That can't be near the fire. Okay. Uh, <laughs> and I got the, it was like a light pink. It wasn't this color, but these suckers were sold. Okay, Lens, hi. Um, these things were sold out. Why isn't it focusing? These things were sold out everywhere or like, you know, these are 22 bucks normally. And the only way I was gonna buy one was if I could find one on sale. <laughs> so Black Friday is the time to do that. And it just, it just comes in like a little plastic. The packaging, I don't care that much about packaging. I, I'd rather things be more uh, environmental. So I'm not, you know, if it doesn't come all fancy, that's fine. But this is just plastic. So if you're, somebody is really into packaging, be aware of that. And I mean, it's nothing fancy. <laughs> but again, I would rather have the beautiful product. But I love this stuff so much. It's very rare. I like trying new things. So it's very rare that when I use up a sample that I go running out and buying the full size unless it's like, you know, the Sunday Riley stuff, you know, I've gone out and purchased the full size of that. But a lip balm, I'm like, meh, I would never spend that kind of money on a lip balm. I would never run out and do that, blah, blah, blah. And then I met this one. <laughs> okay, so there is that. Now, I went to my P.O. box. I did not, this is from Truly. I'm going to talk about this brand here. Okay, um, I did not, oh, they put a little, they got a little, hold on now. I didn't see this. Look, a little smiley face on their tape. How cute is that? Uh, <laughs> I didn't get a shipping notification. So I had no idea that this was sitting in a locker until I went and checked my P.O. box for something else and it was sitting there. So that's something I don't love. <laughs> I, don't, I don't love. So Truly is a brand that does CBD products. I believe it's clean, um, what's that, clean vegan natural, I think, I think that's the deal. Um, but they have it at Ulta as well. And that's where I was first exposed to it. <laughs> it's Christmas for me. Yay. Look at that. Look at all that goodness. Oh, oh my boy. Okay. So what did I get? Wait, wait, was I supposed to get this or is this a bonus? <gasps> Did I get this? I'm confused. I don't remember buying this, so they might have just popped a little goodie in there for me, maybe. Unless I accidentally ordered it. <laughs> I don't know, but this is a hair mask. So, oh yeah, truly organic. That was the word I was leaving out. So this is a rose gold nourishing hair mask. Hi, I need that. Um, rose, rice protein, and 24 karat gold boost. I think they just popped that, uh, maybe they just popped that in? I'm not sure. I don't know. I'm going to look at my list here and see. So this is the cream. I already own this. I already have been using this. This is the CBD anti-aging face cream. Um, all these boxes are going to be all sealed up and everything. But um, this cream, I really, really love it. And I always like, <laughs> it's going to take a minute here. It's, it's really, it, it looks like a jar. Okay. <laughs> and it's white. Uh, but I, you know, anytime I can get a hold of something that's organic and for what it is, and it's natural and all that vegan and all that stuff for what it is and how well it works, it's really a good price point. I believe this is $35 for, for a CBD product. I mean, that's pretty good. And this is 1.8 ounces, 55 milliliters. And, uh, it's lasted me. I've had mine for a month. Now I haven't used it every day because I do, <laughs> I do kind of swap out my products here and there, but I mean, it, it doesn't even look like I've made a dent in it. So truly organic eye candy, anti-puff eye cream. That's the next one I got. I have not used this yet. Again, this was one of those things that here's my chance to try it because they, I think they had, um, 20% off the entire site. Uh, what is this? I think I got some bundles too. Oh, good night moon. So I stocked up on this. This is a product I have been using. I have one of these open already and I knew I want, what is that on the side? Oh, 
ingredients. Um, I knew I wanted to take advantage of the sale and get another one of these. This stuff, I don't want to open it because once you open it, it starts expiring, but it looks like frosting inside of the jar. You can kind of see from on the side. <laughs> it's really cute. It smells amazing and it works very well. And so far, again, I have very, very sensitive skin. So, so far I've had good luck with these products. As I try new products in here, if I have had a reaction, I'll definitely come back and let you know. Here's another one of my favorite products from them. It's a sleep mask. And it's like a, come on lens, come on. I'm not in the mood. <laughs> not my face, not my face. Do this, focus on this. Come on camera, yeah, there you go. That's the other way it focuses if I put it right in front of my face. So this is called Starface Sleep Mask. It's got all kinds of goodies in it. And also the packaging, again, if you're into packaging, this feels like glass and this is a very, very heavy lid on top. So you could even reuse this to hold whatever, you know what I'm saying? All right, so there's that. This I'm really excited to try. This is Purple Rain Glow Serum Facial Booster Retinol Glycolic Acid and Antioxidant Boost. Yes. I was told when I was like 19 years old from somebody at the prescriptives counter. Yes, it was in Columbus, Ohio. I was in college and that woman gave me the best piece of advice. And she said, <laughs> as far as anti-aging goes, uh, if you can get a serum, the serums, she was explaining that they usually have the most beneficial ingredients or whatever, and they soak into the skin better. What is this? And so I, that always stuck with me. And so I always make sure I have a good serum on hand. Uh, okay. <laughs> so for anybody who is uptight about things, or if you have no sense of humor, call a medic. Uh, this, is, <laughs> this is actually a very different color than the one I have. This is a super rich purple color. The one I already have open, um, is lighter, so that's interesting. But anyway, this is called Acai Your Boobies. <laughs> and it's Lifting Boob Polish, Firm and Titan. Okay, now here's the thing with this that I really, really love. So it has all these, you know, really lovely nutrients in there. And the thing with this and the way that I like to use it is I use it right before a bath, okay? Now this product does have, it's not oily. Uh, it feels like a, like a moussey kind of, like. I was gonna say souffle. <laughs> it has kind of a moussey texture to it. And what it does is it gives a bit of slip so that as you're using the product, you can feel for any abnorm abnormalities, okay? So I, I really like that. I, I can recommend this, I can. So the final thing it looks like I have in my box here is two of the eye candies. I don't know if that's correct. I don't know. I think I only got one of these. So I don't know what happened here. Where's my, there's no packing list in here. All right. Well, you know, I want to be fair to the company. So I'm going to, you know, go back online and see what I actually ordered. And if that's a mistake, of course, I'll get the product back to them or whatever. So that's what I've gotten so far. I'm still waiting on my Jeffree Star mystery box. I was only able to get the mini. <laughs> So I've got two products to show you. I think it's probably gonna be like two products in there. Um, I have no idea if that's gonna come before Christmas. I am going to be traveling here in the next couple of weeks or so. And they said flat out it could take 10, 10 weeks, 10 days, not 10 weeks, 10 days to even get them shipped. So it may not get here by the time I leave for the holidays. <laughs> but uh, I got that and a concealer. The C5 was the color I chose. I've never used those concealers, so I don't know if that's the right color for me, but I believe that was the one that got stolen in the giant heist, uh, which was weird. Cause when I went and put it in my cart, I, I went back and I was like, was that the one that got stolen? And I think it was. So that is still on its way. So I have a couple of things from Target. Oh, I gotta tell you, update on Macy's. Okay, so if you didn't check out um, my vlog, <laughs> I went into Macy's, I returned the shoes. The woman was like, oh my goodness, I can't believe this happened. And then she said, and it took like no time whatsoever. And then she says to me, it probably would have been better if you just, sh well, excuse me, let me, let me be very fair here. Her exact words were, it probably would have been better 
to ship this back. That way they can deal with it directly. And I didn't know how to take that. I was like, you mean I should have paid for return shipping instead of bringing it to the store? I didn't really know how to take that. But <laughs> so I got those returned and I actually ended up getting a black pair just like those shoes and they are really good shoes. Like they feel nice. Uh, it'll work fine with this outfit that I got that I also bought from Macy's for a Christmas dinner I'm going to. So when that happens, uh, of course it's Vlogmas, so I will be vlogging that if I remember. <laughs> Hopefully I don't just vlog in the morning and forget to get the outfit and everything. So I will do that. Oops, I've got boxes falling around everywhere. <laughs> falling around anywhere. So anyway, it's been a very long day. I think I'm just gonna leave it there. Sending y'all so much love and take care. Ow, my foot fell asleep. <laughs> but um, can I be cuter with some more light, please? Please. Oh, will this work? Did that do anything? Nope. <laughs> Hold on. Got another one. Ugh. Am I cute now? How about now? How about now? How about now? I have a ring light, but I'm sitting on the floor and it doesn't do much. Anyway.